Who cares if you can improvise and play a thousand notes? Licks and tricks. If 999 notes out of 1000 sound like an elephant bawling or a cow in labor. Do you work on your sound? How often do you work on your sound? Let us know in the comment section below. Hi saxophone, Kadrian here, the sax habit coach. Now the goal of every saxophonist from the absolute beginner to the pro of pros is to master improvisation like Charlie Parker or Michael Brecker. That is a solid and great goal. But did you know it's not the most important element to be mastered on the horn? Sound is the most important, the most difficult to achieve and the most neglected, especially by beginner saxophone players. Sound is king, rhythm is queen. Everything else such as phrasing, articulation, harmonic structure, and improvisation are the helpers to the king and queen to create a melodious kingdom, music. Your sound is the first thing that a listener hears when you play your horn. That's one of the reasons saxophonists spend time searching for the perfect mouthpiece. The mouthpiece is one of the most important pieces of accessories. The mouthpiece is more important than the horn itself. If you spend all your time searching for the perfect mouthpiece, piece, ligature, read, saxophone, never really digging into sound development. You will sound just as terrible as if you never had that setup. Playing lots of licks, tricks, and repertoire doesn't automatically improve your sound. If you want to build huge biceps, you have to do exercises that are specifically geared toward those muscle groups. General exercise of your body won't do much. Sound has to be attended to specifically. George Garzon once said, a lot of the students he's taught at Berklee College of Music come with great technique, but their sound is usually terrible. He said he wished he could somehow cut their tongues out if that were possible to fix their song. If you do not know who George Garzon is, the late legendary Michael Brecker once said, I am not the master of the sax, George Garzon is. If you're finding value in what I'm saying here, drop us a like to help the algorithm share this content. Because sound is the most important, the most difficult to achieve, you must work on it every single practice session. You can start by practicing with a mouthpiece. the mouth piece and the neck only. Do long tones. Do some overtones. The beauty about it, you don't need to spend two or three hours a day to work on your sound to get results. 10 to 15 minutes daily stacks up and will transform your sound significantly when done consistently. Stick with one exercise long enough to experience the results. Remember, sound is king. It's sound before anything you play. People will recognize you more for your sound than they will by what you play because no one knows what you're playing. Beautiful sound is beautiful sound, according to George Garzon. Who cares? if you can improvise and play a thousand notes, licks and tricks. If 999 notes out of 1000 sound like an elephant bawling or a cow in labor. It's not even so much the exercise you do that will guarantee you positive results. It's how often it is done. Research has shown why some people lose weight and others don't. Almost any diet will work. The problem is most people don't stick to one diet long enough to see results. Most people are not consistent. That is a key factor. It has more to do with how often you do a thing than the thing you are doing. Don't expect to see any results from any tone building exercises if you have not committed at least 30 consecutive days to it. Did you learn to form all the sentences? sentences in a day, a week, a month, or even a year that you know used to speak daily? Hell no. Music is no different. It's a foreign language. You must learn it as such. If you have not signed up for my free 5-minute tone builder course, now is the time to do that and start transforming your saxophone sound. The link is in the description below. You can find it at www.kadrianthomas.com. Wait, what are you waiting for? Click the link below. And as always, that's a friend. Push, play, until something happens. Peace.